A common setup for doing full screen post processing shaders in Godot, such as the CRT effect I have here, is to put a canvas layer somewhere in your scene tree, make a full screen color rect the child of it, and put the shader as a material on that color rect. And this generally works, but the problem you may run into is that UI elements Godot needs to dynamically generate at runtime, such as the list of options on my option button, are not impacted by the shader. And the reason for this is that these dynamically generated items are rendered at layer 1024. So the fix is to just raise the canvas layer to be higher than that. The problem is that the UI actually caps out at 128 and you can't go that high. What you can do though, is put a script on your canvas layer and programmatically set the layer higher than what the UI allows. So with it set to 1025, now my shader is being drawn above all of these dynamically generated UI elements and we can see that the option button is now appropriately rendered according to the effect that I have in place.